So I'm Anna Robbins and I live in Wellsville and we've been here for 10 years. Um, I have four kids, a 15 year old, 12 year old, 9 year old and 7 year old. And I've been homeschooling since my oldest was in first grade. So she did preschool and kinder and then we decided to homeschool from then on. Um, so at the time I only had two and I was pregnant with my third one and we kind of started doing more of a classical, um, what is called a classical education. So there was a lot of memorization, repetition and stuff and um, it's kind of evolved over the years I have, as I have learned more and more um, about child development and other philosophies of education. Um, so we tried, we tried that classical one with Anna, it worked really good, with my first one worked really good um, because she was really good at absorbing everything and um, being under a very structured schedule, but then with my second one, <clears throat> my boy, that was a little bit of a challenge. He learns through movement, and he's very visual, and he just needed way more than just sitting down um, to learn. So that kind of stretched out my... <laughs> um, yeah, it just stretched me so I needed to learn new ways of doing thing, things here at home. So um, with my second one, I started reading a Castilian books about kids and how to learn through movement and all that and just explored all sorts of curriculums because there is so many out there. Um, anything that had a lot of manipulatives for math and even language. Um, and then um, in the process of doing that, I discovered the Well-Educated Heart and the Thomas Jefferson Leadership Education. Um, so this is probably about five years ago. And that's kind of when I started letting go a little bit more of the structure um, in realizing now with my younger ones that um, it pays off a little bit more to learn through play, and um, we do a lot of reading together as a family, with the little ones especially. Um, reading classics and just whatever is good and wholesome. Um, as far as what we do, it kind of changes every year depending, or even within the year, depending on the kids interest and in what they're at. Um, well, most of the time about once a year I'll sit down with them and kind of talk about what they're interested in and the things that they want to learn and some goals and I also guide them because they might not know um, what's out there. So I give them options um, and we explore options together and that's kind of what we decide basically a program for the year and then um, and then I have them um, we work together to create a schedule so I have a schedule for each one with all the different subjects and things that we want to work on 